Hello everybody, this is Steve from Camping in a Bell Tent. I didn't get to go live Saturday night, I'm sorry, it just didn't work out, it was too cold. But today we are uh, having a big storm come and uh, this is right at the beginning. I don't know how bad it's going to get, but they say it could get pretty bad. So I got her rolling. Let's we'll see what happens. I did reinforce my, uh, I got the top on my kitchen. That was me a light hanging up. Four's done. A temporary back, and I've just got through putting some reinforcement straps from the top to the bottom, inside out, where if the wind gets up real high, it won't blow it away. But uh, I've got the tent all shut down. Uh, so, uh, I've learned I'm just not going to be in it in high wind. There's too many trees, and I'm scared one's going to fall. And if I'm out here, I can run. Where if I'm in there, I'll just get crushed. So I'm going to stay out here while it comes, and it should be here any minute if it's going to get bad. If you would, go down there and hit the like and subscribe button. I really would appreciate it. It means a lot to me. And it doesn't cost you a dime. Just uh, go right down there and uh, click on it. I see a bunch of you have, and I really appreciate it. It's uh, climbing up pretty quick. But it sounds like it's getting close. What do y'all think? I'm holding the camera, so if I move around a lot, I'm sorry. But uh, I want to be mobile in case it gets real bad real quick where I can jump up. So far, it's kind of muggy. I've got sweat on my face. You know, I do have something coming up that everybody might watch for. Uh, my mother spent the uh, better part of her life living completely off grid when she was a child, up to she was in uh, high school. And uh, she's 91 years old and she's agreed to uh, come down here and uh, make a documentary of uh, what is it really like living off grid. It's not the bed of roses everybody says it is. It's really hard and cruel. I mean, nowadays people think of living off grid. It's kind of like what I've got set up here where I could afford to fix it nice. A lot of people back in the day where people really live off grid, they didn't have anything. I haven't got close. Old Bama Jack, he says he's staying with his daddy. Ain't you, buddy? You got worry on your face, son. You know daddy will take care of you. Y'all, it's starting to pick up pretty fast.
You'll see people ask, how good is them bell tents in a storm? There you go. If you lock them down good, they ain't going nowhere. You'd have to really, really, really get bad. We may do that this time. We'll see. see right up there, right up there on the porch, you can see the water pouring off that rain canopy, but it's not even getting on the tent. It's still dry all the way around the tent, about 10 inches. That's a really, really, really good fitting rain canopy. It hangs over about, uh, about 12, 15 inches is what you need. This is a storm, everybody. You know, it's hard to sleep in a bell tent when it's coming a storm like this. All you think about is these big trees falling on you. And at least that's all I think about. After this winter with that big snow and all them big limbs started falling off, I was like, oh, me. If it starts blowing really hard, y'all, I may have to run. If you look right out there in the field, it's blowing really hard.
everybody you want to meet my dog this is Bama Jack he's my buddy he goes wherever I go and never runs he'll stay with me no matter what you see that right there thing on his collar if you have a dog you love you need to get one of them. It's called attractive. And uh, it attracts your dog step by step in live mode. It's really, really unbelievable. It looks like we beat this storm. It's going to rain, but it's lightening up a little bit. And uh, it's taking probably a day or so for this water to go away. But we got to good rain out of it. A corn field right out there will do really good. So everybody, this is Steve camping in a bell tent. Will a bell tent survive a storm? Yes, it will. Many of them. All you gotta do is look back in my uh, videos and you can see some really big storms. They're tough if you set them up right. I hope you like it. Have a good day. God bless you. Bye-bye.